Uh, so, um, folks, I've been working my way through them, actually. Um, oh, I don't know. Um, halfway through this book, um, Lives of the Signers. And this was published uh, back in, I believe, eight, 1848. Uh, so, you know, there's no revisionary um, BS, right, in this book. Um, and there's some great tidbits um, of information, you know, actually fascinating. Um, and if you want to know how bad um, the Tories were, and, and I would consider them the Democrat communist we're dealing with now, that are siding with a tyrannical government uh, instead of, um, you know, our individual liberties and the right to govern ourselves. So, um, it's a footnote that's in this book. Tories. The Tories of the Revolution were far more despised, and justly so, uh, by the patriots than the mercenary troops of Great Britain. They not only lifted their hands against their own brethren, but in many cases their treachery and cruelty exceeded the worst acts of the British soldiery. During the winter, when the American army was suffering everything but death at Valley Forge, the interior of Pennsylvania swarmed with Tories. And when Washington, by order of Congress, proceeded to take by force the grain and other food which the Tory farmers refused to sell to the army, they in some instances burnt their product rather than have it feed the starving um, Americans. So um, Tories were really pieces of crap. Um, a lot of them fled to Canada and went to Britain uh, after we won the revolution. Um, and um, when we win this second revolution, uh, hopefully Democrat communists will flee this country and go somewhere too. Because I have no use for them. They are the Tories of today. All right, just thought I'd share that with you. If you want to pick up a copy of this, this book at uh, Wall Builders. Uh, matter of fact, I'll find the link and you can get Wives of the Signers. Great book too. Uh, this one's very excellent. I, I enjoyed Wives of the Signer uh, too, to, to be honest. Um, but I'll leave the link for it in the description to this video. Thank you.